I'm Deanna Lorraine and I am running in California's 12th district against Nancy Pelosi. Join me on my journey for God, country, and family. I recently decided to run against Nancy Pelosi because I am outraged over the way that she's been treating American citizens and American families. We need to bring our families back together. We need to bring America back together. And the way that she's been running her own district is the way that she will be running America. We can't have that. I want America to be strong. I want America to be prosperous. And I want to make America great again. One of the biggest things I'll be focusing on is a strong and sensible immigration system because it is the moral and compassionate thing to have a common sense immigration system and a big, beautiful wall. This is the America that we want. These are the values that we want. This is the destiny we want, and we want to remain a sovereign nation. In order to remain a sovereign nation, we've got to have laws, and we've got to have a wall. The other thing I'll be focusing on is repairing the family unit and the institute of marriage, because strong families create a strong America. And I'll be focusing on making sure that our nation remains a sovereign nation. And for that, we need to have complete and total free speech. No more censorship, especially of conservatives. We need to fight this and we need to end this censorship and the monopoly control that big tech has over America. I will call for the breakup of these big tech companies and making sure that we save and restore our religious liberty. I want you to say, I love this president. I love you. We have love for our country and pride in our country again. And all of you guys, we need you to stand up and fight. I never thought I'd be here five years ago or even six months ago. I never was into politics. I never even dreamed I would be a politician or be into politics like many of you guys. But what I am is I am a concerned and passionate America. And I will never let the America that I love go down in flames and sit idly by why it does. Now is the time for ordinary Americans to do bold, extraordinary things, and that's what I'm doing, to save America, the America that I love, the California that I grew up in. And I call all of you to do the same. I want you guys to follow me on my journey, support me, because I need all the help that I can get to beat and unseat Nancy Pelosi. I will fight with every last breath to make sure that we preserve the America that we love and preserve our God-given free speech to preserve the American dream and Americans' exceptionalism. At a time where we're very divided right now, we have the one thing, the national anthem, which we should all be able to stand for and all stand behind. And no matter what our race, no matter what our gender, so I say that this is an attack on our free speech and we really need to fight this. We're wanting to put Americans first and our safety and protection and prosperity first over other countries and there's nothing wrong with that whatsoever. If this isn't the biggest piece of evidence that uh, college education, quote unquote, is no longer education, this is full-blown indoctrination. They're indoctrination machines and very expensive ones at that. We can make America great again. We can make love great again, but we have to remember who we are. We have to remember the spirit and the values that once made America so great. And here we are doing that. Everyone there was so tired of being told that they had to vote Democrat just because they're black, or they had to be a victim just because they're black. Because when we have strong relationships between men and women, and we have a strong family, we have a strong country. Uh, out of your chair and shout, I love America. I love and we will win this fight. God bless you and God bless America. Thank you so much, and I can't wait to meet all of you guys.